hi guys welcome back to my channel and i hope you are doing well um today it's tuesday the 15th and um trying all my best to make a week flow but i will see how it goes i will at least see because this one i think is gonna be different from the videos that i normally do which is your cleaning motivation so I, i'm just feeling like doing a vlog just to take you guys through my week so um today it's tuesday i'm going to town now um i want to buy some uh track tops for abigail if maybe there's also pants i'll also buy because um two weeks two weeks back yes i bought her winter clothes already but i felt like um they were not enough because now um it's cold this week actually since last week it has been cold so she has been wearing them and i just felt like we have not started winter yet i think um it's towards this month end starting month end which is like in a week time if i'm not mistaken or is it next week so is it yeah I, i'm not sure because today is the 15th so 31st because i know first week of august already um around 6 a.m is dark like it's like it's 4 it's 4 a.m and around 6 p.m because in summer 6 p.m there's sunlight you know but now it's getting dark at like 5 30 so meaning winter is here so yeah i want to go um to pep store and check what they have because you know guys i buy um my daughter's clothes there and i really really love and another thing that i i want to go back and buy more is because last last year i bought her winter clothes and most of the clothes uh the material was not good like after washing them they'll start have to have those things so i was like i'll never buy um the track suits there so this year i bought and i washed them i think twice or yeah i think twice ever since i purchased them and they're still fresh they're still looking good so that's where i'm going back to buy more so the time is 10 30 now so guys um without any waste of time let's go it's been a while ever since i was ever since i i did the the lifestyle vlogs so that's what i'll take you through everything that i'm doing that's if this phone won't disappoint me because um it was on the charge i think it was 30 percent so i'll just see so let's go
Meaning I didn't take long. Um, like I told you guys, I was going to buy some um, track, actual track suits for ABK for winter. Because last week, uh, not last week, two weeks back, I bought her the winter clothes already. Just that I didn't buy too much of the track suit because I thought like um, the material was like the ones that I bought last year. So I noticed that they changed the material. So the way I went there, guys. I was like, there's no way I'm going to buy them. I really, really love this material. Here. And um, from the previous um, clothes that I bought here, this are uh, one of the boots that I bought here. Um, they also come from Pep, Pep store. Actually, it's Pep now. Huh? So yeah, they come from Pep, and I think they were 103 pounds if I'm not mistaken and I don't know I have not checked yet how much is hundred and three hundred in dollars um, or in Kenya shillings <laughs> so um, this was hundred and three rand and it says four says four is like 22 yeah I know in some countries they use that other um, numbers to the sizes so um, says four is 22 this was um it was 29.99 30 rand and i bought two of these but different designs i also bought this one so she can put inside when she's going to school and it was um 29.99 as well i bought the socks because i really love the happy socks that i bought for for her from pep last um two weeks ago and i was like i'm going for more so i bought her this once as well and this was 17.99 this was like 18 rand and it's two pairs same here i did the same thing two pairs same price 17.99 and i bought her the head that comes with the gloves so i bought this hat and it comes with the gloves it was 39.99 40 rand and i bought this i really love this one and i love the color um it's a mini mouse um disney baby this was um 59.99 okay this was 59.99 the first track suit that i bought here and got so so affordable it's like 59.99 60 rand and it's two pairs this material so here is the first one here okay it comes with the the top with the hoodie and the pant of course and um the second one this one is velvet on is velvet material and um it was 99 99.99 99, 100 rent so this one's so fluffy and stretchy i love love this i bought her this as well and this was 89.99 90 rent 
I bought her this um, tracksuit as well. Um, it's the same as the first one, but it's just the different color. Um, I think, yeah, $59.99 as well. It was 60 rand. And this one is 90 rand, $89.99. I love, love this one. And I love this color. How can I forget this? I've been looking for this. Um, I don't know what they call them. Oh, coasters. Okay, now I know. I bought this. Um, and I love the fact that they are brown. I'm going to put on my, my countertop there. It's also brown. My, uh, my table, office space table. Office table. Why am I saying this? Office table is on as well, and I really, really love to take my book while I'm busy on my laptop. So I really, really love this, and there are four inside, and this was 19 hand. welcome back today it's monday the 21st and i have not been following up with this vlog unfortunately i got demotivated and even now at this point i'm so demotivated i'm not going to lie reason being i hope the lighting is not too much here okay it's fine reason being um my tripod broke the small tripod and I'm holding my phone right now, which is something that I really hate. So, just for content's sake. So, let me just show you guys. I want to clean my kitchen right now. I also want to make um, a coffee station. I was just want to make it more nice than before. And then, yeah, let me show you how the kitchen looks like now. So, this is how the kitchen looks like now and i have to wash those dishes and yay yay i bought um a coffee machine and i have to wash that um what do you call last kettle and yeah that's that's basically that i just need to clean this um place and tidy it up Last week, Francis and I, we were looking at the pamphlet from Game Store and we saw a coffee machine there and I was busy emphasizing on it that I really love it and I would appreciate if you can buy it for me. I would be so happy. And the response that I got was, I will see if I can buy it, but it's not the priority right now. So I knew I was not going to get it anytime soon. So I was like, okay, it's fine. And then after three days, that's when he came with this um, coffee machine and I was so excited. I was really excited and I've decided that I'm going to change my coffee station. You know, I'm a coffee lover, so wherever there's coffee, I'm just happy. So I'm thinking of buying um, coffee beans, Ethiopian coffee beans. Um, we do have in the house, but I don't know if I don't know. Actually, I don't know if I know how to roast them. I tried once and I didn't like it. So Francis told me that when he has time, when he gets time, he will definitely host them for me.
came with this event. Uh, I've been waiting for this baby for so long. Okay, and the parsley. Bantana! What is it? You're tired, eh? Yeah. So what happened? You're like, I'm coming back now, now. Oh, and the uh, onions, white onions, and you know, I thought that uh, this one's gonna come back late because I saw the weather changing. Mm. Was it busy though, like in town? Yeah, 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 close. Serious? Oh, it's public holiday. Yeah. Oh, I didn't forget. And then sweet corn. I didn't forget about that. Okay? Are these lemons or oh, narkis? Oh, they're still raw. Yeah. And then we have narkis here. Did you get the beans? No. And then we have um, red apples. Mm -hmm. That's fine. I knew it. I knew it. Pastors always buy this waffle. Waffles, why am I saying like this? And you ate one of it. And you can't finish it. I can't finish it. It's too sweet. Yeah, I was talking to uh, my homies here. I was talking to Mama today. Uh, I sent a video of it today. And this, yeah, every day is something else. She's crying she's for the, what are these? Oh, um, what, do you, what do they call this? Oh, yeah, nectar beans. I wanted to say peaches, but these are not peaches. <laughs> yeah, but that shop is expensive. Sure. And then we have fruits and some vegetables in the house. Tomatoes. Oh, every day she was trying for the new dishes. Mm. Mm. Some bananas. Oh, thank you, Shirley. I mean, I was like, the you don't And some chicken. Thank you so much. And yeah, that's that. I think that's that for today. I'm not going to. I always use vinegar to wash my vegetables and um, foods. I know a lot of people are using dish um, washer soap to wash the vegetables. I've never tried it, um, but it's something that I don't think I will try. As long as I have my vinegar in the house, then I'm good to go. If I don't have it, I will just use plain water. So I was um, very pleased with Francis because I didn't even tell him that we've ran out of vegetables in the house you know when you don't have tomato in the house then you know that you don't have vegetables in the house because that's one vegetable that we normally use you know like in my house tomato and onion i Mama. always use them Mama. every day Mama. in my food so um mommy i'm really sorry about that and then um, i also like spices such as um your celery parsley and rosemary Unfortunately, in the shop that we normally buy them, they have run out of rosemary. I think it's been some time now. So, at this moment, I'm just going to blend celery with um, with parsley. I normally blend them together with ginger, raw ginger, and garlic. But unfortunately, I've run out of ginger as well. That's why I'm using the ginger powder. I hope you guys are enjoying this content and kindly give this video a thumbs up comment down below let me know what do you use to wash your vegetables and fruits because i know a lot of people are using dishwasher soap so just tell me um if you are using a uh, dishwasher soap and you tell me the reason why and yeah let's interact let's interact guys
It's butter chicken and chicken, I don't remember, but not chicken biryani. So I just mixed two of them inside here. And I'm just going to sprinkle out this thing. And then <coughs> I'm going to put it on the stove. And then I'm going to add um, crushed garlic. And I think I'm good to go. Later on, I'm going to blend my parsley and celery and onion and tomato. And then I'm going to add it inside here. How I wish you could smell the spices that I'm busy chopping now. As we know that parsley has that strong smell and I really really love that smell. And if maybe you get a chance, just try these um, spices out. Um, celery, parsley, garlic. Yeah, garlic is optional and ginger as well. Blend it together with tomato into your food. Whatever, stew, chicken, even fish like it goes it goes very very well with those proteins that i've just mentioned just try it out and then let me know how it tastes like because for me this this really tastes so 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 good Secret so here i have my rice still cooking boiling and have my chicken and I've added um, the spices already so I'm just waiting for it um, the water to train so I can fry it and then add the 
this mixture. In here, I have parsley, celery, onion, um, and tomatoes. As I was cooking, I later decided to cook um, the butternut as well, and this was very delicious, very smooth, very tasty. Because um, when I cook it, I add small water, just not too much, just a pinch of water, and then once the water is drained, I add oil and sugar and cinnamon. But adding cinnamon is optional, just for the the flavor but today i just added um the, the sugar so that's how normally how i normally cook my pumpkin my butternut i just add sugar oil and cinnamon so um it was very delicious i'm not going to lie you will also see um, the picture at the end of the video of the food that i cooked can you please give me that small Say 